closet. Um, I pushed my cleaning service back from every two weeks to once a month. So my, I'm preparing for my cleaning um, crew to get here, which is just one person. Um, so I am in my closet trying to put my clothes away because my goal <laughs> has been to like when my when the cleaning folks come all of my stuff is put away where it's supposed to be put away and my house is like perfectly clean so i had laundry we ain't gonna act like we all well majority of us don't do our laundry put it on the bed push it to the side and then go sleep so um but <laughs> i did my laundry like before i went on vacation to the festival in Philadelphia and then um, I started putting it up last weekend so it's it's finally done it's finally getting put away now I only have this small um, hamper that I keep in my closet with dirty laundry and my goal now is going to be to clean the dirty laundry but immediately put it away so we'll see how successful I am at any rate I am here because I wanted to kind of give y'all an update on what my closet looks like clean i think a couple of videos back i showed you guys the closet and it was a hot mess and it's still kind of a mess uh, but i'm still putting things away i need to color coordinate again because my goal has been just to get the stuff hung up so i'm going to continue doing what i'm doing I still have to go and make my bed and stuff, and I want to take a shower before she gets here. She gets here at 9 o'clock. It is 8.30, so I don't know how quick I can be, but we're gonna, we're just going to go for it, okay? So I will see y'all in a minute, or I'll talk to y'all in a minute, but I just want to see if I can hurry up and get this stuff done, hop in the shower, go log in for work. So see you in a minute. <music> have to do is hop in the shower. Alexa, what time is it? It's 6.46 Okay, so I got like 15 minutes. She might not get here until um, 9.30 anyway. So I'm going to hop in the shower really quick and I'll see y'all at the desk. Talk to you later. Bye. All right, y'all. So it is time for work. I'm going to log into work and get my work done hopefully early today so I can get off early today, but I doubt it. Anyway, I just wanted to tell y'all that I'm going to work, so I'll see y'all later. Bye. Good evening, guys. 
as you can see, it is the end of the day. Well, it's well past the end of the day. And I have already changed into my favorite thing to wear around the house. A hoodie and some sweats or some leggings with today's sweats. Uh, and I'm about to make myself a tea. Let me show y'all how I'm going to whip this up real quick. So, my gra, my sis, my good sis, Jenny, got me addicted to this. So, I can drink them separately, but I like to mix them. So, that's what we're going to do today. And we are about that easy life. We're about that soft life. We're about the easy life. So we like to use lemon and lime juice that is already squeezed, squeezed, <laughs> squeezed <laughs> for us. And I am going to use my salted caramel syrup and put it all together and it's going to be delicious. All right. So I got my ice in my handy dandy Starbucks cold cup. Y'all know I used to work there, so I still have a ton of their merch. Uh, I mean, why would I get rid of it? Um, I am going to pour a liberal amount of the salted caramel because I don't know, it's something about the salted part of the salted caramel that gives this drink a little bit, you know, a little bit more of a kick than you would expect. Then I'm going to take my handy dandy lime squeeze. It's organic. And I'm going to squeeze as much of it as I want because it's Friday. <clears throat> Shake that passion tea up really good. I shake it before every pour. And I'm just going to give myself half of this. And this is the awake. Not, nothing caffeine keeps me awake. I, I don't know. I've been drinking coffee since I was a baby. <laughs> so it don't phase me. Um, pour the rest of the way with that tea. Then we're going to put our straw in. And give it a little stir, if you will. Y'all, I'm so tired. It is quarter end and work-life balance is not a thing during this time. And this is a really cool color. Y'all see how it changed colors? It was red, but it changed colors. Anyway. And then I'm going to enjoy this. I think I have nothing else. It was so good. That, I don't know. Something about that um, salted caramel syrup and it's it's the one that's made by this brand i don't think it matters though but uh it's something about that salted caramel syrup that i don't know it gives it like i think it's the salted part of it that gives it like a a kick that you're not expecting and then the lime juice I was going to do lemons because those lemons that I put in that bowl over there are still good. And I'm just kind of like, okay, is it the bowl? Because usually when I sit fruit out in a bowl, it starts to shrivel up. And there's two oranges and like six lemons and they still look okay. Things that make you a mm. All right. So I think that's all that I have for today, y'all. Yeah, I'm exhausted. Um, like I said, it is, we're preparing for quarter close at work next week. So today was mad. It was mad. Okay. And I'm just like delusional right now, but thankfully, uh, as I was showing y'all this morning, the cleaner came. That's why I abruptly finished, uh, recording this morning. I had a couple of wardrobe changes because I wanted to, uh, you know, post an outfit on my Instagram. Um, we had wings out for lunch, which I regret, but I will be going to the gym in the morning. I'm going to have to set myself up for success um, by really putting in effort at the gym starting tomorrow. I, I put effort in, but I could do a little bit more. Um, what else did we do today? We cleaned the closet. 
Are we, yes, we cleaned the closet because we had clothes everywhere. I had laundry on the bed. I woke up with laundry in my bed. So that's the first thing that I did when I got up this morning because I didn't want the cleaning lady to come and be like, oh, this slob. So, so I put my laundry up and yeah. Um, so I think I'm just going to go to sleep because I don't want to cook anything. The kitchen is clean. Everything is clean. And I, I'm like, it can at least stay this way for the weekend and then. Sunday maybe I'll do something in here um anyway y'all I'm tired so I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow thank you so much for watching I'll see y'all tomorrow trying to do like daily vlogs or just like record stuff daily uh, but y'all know it, it's just not that interesting because all I do is work but yesterday I went outside and I think I captured some of that and today I'm going outside I don't think I recorded yesterday but today I'm going out because my friend out here in Dallas her name is Satavia I'll put the link to all of her stuff in the description box she is having a soft launch of her new product line so I'm gonna bring y'all with me but first I want to show y'all what I'm thinking that I'm going to wear so first of all I have like other stuff on my bed because I was deciding what I'm gonna wear but I'm like it's so hot here in Texas it's like a hundred degrees at this point um, so this is like a dress that I pulled out of my swimwear <laughs> drawer and it was like a dress that I used last year. I got it from Nordstrom as a cover up, um, when I went to Mexico. So sis is going to wear this dress. What I don't know, I'm going to wear this Adidas hat because y'all know I'm still trying to figure out what I'm going to do with my hair, but I'm going to wear this Adidas hat. What I do not know what I'm going to do is... Uh, what shoes I'm gonna wear so let me just show y'all what I'm thinking and I'm leaning towards the sneaker but I can also pull off the sandal so um I'm thinking either this chunky dad sandal or this chunky sneaker and I'm leaning towards the sneaker because of comfort of course <laughs> um and it's just it's just gonna give like the outfit a little bit more of a boost especially with the hat look i'm gonna wear the sneaker <laughs> it's because it is gonna give the outfit a little bit more of like something else than this this shoe could give because um it's just it's like a popping ass sneaker like it's a wave runner duh like why wouldn't i wear this <laughs> But yeah, I think I'm going to wear this shoe. So now I'm going to steam the dress. And then once I steam the dress, I'll get in the shower. And I'm going to put some makeup on today because I don't have any eyelashes. And I'm not on camera right now because I just don't feel like adjusting it. But this is the fit with my Glamaholic uh, mesh backpack. So yeah, let's get ready. <music>
I just left the event. Well, I left the event probably about an hour ago. Um, but I bought one of each of the products because they were that good. Um, and I bought Michael his own oil. So uh, I am excited to share with you guys what I got. And if you're interested, of course, I will put the links to all of her social media down below so you can go and support a black -owned, black owned business um i am i am in a state of a food coma right now and i'm still probably about 45 minutes away from home so i'm gonna stop at my cousin's house and just kind of sit over there while my food digest because i just left this really fantastic um um I don't Greek. It was a Greek food, I believe, and it was amazing except for the rice, the the raisins in the rice. But um, yeah, so I'm gonna go since I'm already on this side of town. I'm gonna go and say hi to my family before I head back to Fort Worth, and then when I get home, I'll show you guys what I bought from my friend's event. So I will see you guys later. Hey, you guys. So. I am back from my day outside <laughs> and as promised I wanted to come back and show you guys the things that I got from my uh, my friends line so it's a body hair and body um, product line so it's basically oils and shea butter body scrub etc etc so I will show you guys what I got so I got one of everything because you know support black businesses so let me just give you guys a quick look at what i got hope this lighting is okay because the light whatever so and i didn't come straight home so it kind of melted in my car so I'm, i need to let it solidify so i'm probably not gonna open it up to show y'all but i will maybe when it solidifies i'll show y'all what it looks like but I'm, I don't want it to like, I don't want to lose any of the product because it's like top tier. Uh, but basically, the product line is called You Define Natural. That is the, the uh, brand name. And I got the Whipped Shea Butter, uh, or it's called Whipped Shea. So it, the ingredients are shea butter, coconut oil, avocado oil, grapeseed oil castor oil and vitamin e with peppermint and tea tree oil um as essential and this one was is 2.0 ounces um this is how the packaging looks um and it smells really good and this can be used i believe on your hair and body and then I got the sugar scrub. Um, this this fragrance is lemon and eucalyptus. Oh my god! That was MJ. He just came from walking in this weather here, and y'all know my baby is like he has respiratory issues, so we have to be very care careful. Anyway, <laughs> so as I was saying, this is the sugar scrub. Uh, this one is lemon and eucalyptus, and she had another. Um, fragrance i'll put the link to her um instagram below but again this smells so good uh it's the lemon and eucalyptus um sugar scrub and it the ingredients include coconut oil shea butter uh it's alcohol and fragrance free no preservative or whatever um, and then I got two of the hair and scalp oils, uh, one for me and one for Michael because he likes to use my stuff. So the ingredients are, of course, are all oils. So you have almond, apricot, jojoba, castor, tea tree, uh, peppermint, and orange bitter. Um, and then finally I got the nourishing body oil and this one includes sunflower avocado almond castor and vitamin e oil and this one smells like pea most of the rest of mostly everything has like a peachy fragrance to it except for of course the lemon and eucalyptus uh that smells really good though so yeah uh i'm so proud of her i'm so happy 
uh, that she finally went ahead and launched her her line and I think it's gonna do really good so if you're interested she I think ships nationwide we'll, we'll see I'll ask her but I'll put her information down in the description box so yeah I'm gonna go see about my baby because he's at my door with his huffing and puffing and I just gotta make sure he's okay so I will talk to y'all tomorrow bye